Hey there, YouTube land, Big Dave here. So it's Wednesday. When I started this process, it was 9 o'clock. Um, we're, we're like on the third video now. That's not working. Um, we have issues. Memory issues or some other thing. Um, but anyway, so here I am. I'm in the uh, office space. And I'm working on workflow. Um, you know, whatever kind of job you have or whatever you do, you have to have uh, a workflow. This is my coffee. You have to have coffee. You have to have a workflow that keeps your life organized. Otherwise, you're going to have uh, difficulties, you know? So here's stuff I just got. <clears throat> just got this packet in the mail. Uh, it's going to be for a big wedding that's coming up the end of March. It's very involved. It's in a big church, big wedding. There's going to be a choir, several instrumentalists. My job is to play the flute. And um, I have 26 pages of music and information regarding this situation that I have to go over. Um, so I will practice through some of this music. Not today. I'm just uh, I'm just doing the office work right now. <clears throat> so after I review, um, let me just say that the person that sent this to me is someone you know I work for um, on a not a regular basis, but uh, I do work for that person uh, periodically, and they're very organized. So everything it's laid out on here. Everything tells me what I have to do. There's two pages of itinerary and instructions. Um, and all the music is already labeled and set up and everything like that. Now what I'm going to do before I even practice it is I'll review and flip through the music to see if there's anything that's kind of irregular. And I noticed something before, like in this particular song, um, there's some penciled in parts. And I checked, and uh, there's another song that also has penciled in parts. So those are obviously like harmony. So what I will do is I'll play through some of this on the piano just to see what it kind of sounds like. And then I'll uh, see how my harmony parts or these counter melodies, uh, contrapuntal things work with this music that I, I'm not that familiar with this music. Some of like two things in here I am, but the other things I'm not. So I have to, uh, you know... And also where the cuts are, like there's things that are cut. You know, I that's the stuff I have to... I'm not worried about playing the notes and the music. You know, I, I'm, I'll take my flute out and I'll play through it and it won't be that big of a deal. But it's the logistics and how it's going to work. Okay, the next thing I will do, once I check to see that there's nothing like irregular or out of uh, sync here or out of order... Uh, I'll take my green sharpie or maybe another color purple or whatever. I won't use red You know, uh, I like a color that's not too crazy to distract my eye, but I'll number all the pages in the order that I receive this in now this music um, Is mine I can mark it or whatever and after I'm done with that. I'm going to decide whether I want to hole, hole punch this or put it in plastic sleeves and then it's going to go in a binder, black binder. Now, I keep these black binders. Uh, there's just one-inch binders. I get these from uh, whoever has them, like, on sale. And I always keep four or five or six of them here ready to go. So I just take a new binder, and I set up my music for whatever things I have coming up that I get a packet of music for. I organize it myself. Um, and I find that helps me just to be completely ready and organized for what I have to do. Um, the only thing about plastic pages is if I think I'm going to a rehearsal where there's going to be a lot of pencil marking, then uh, I'll save, I won't do the plastic pages right away. I'll, um, I might just put the music in a folder, like a two-sided folder, go to the rehearsal, make all my markings, and then I'll do the binder later. So that's like a logistics kind of thing also. All right. So anyway, 
this is not really going to be a big long video about anything it's in fact it's uh, almost five minutes so this is really what I wanted to do I'm uh, here in the office doing uh, this type of thing uh, like I said I started nine o'clock this morning and then the uh, this thing cut off twice already on me because of memory problems but I cleared it so it seems to be all right uh, I didn't shut me off yet all right so that's it it's Wednesday and I hope this information is useful to you or at least it makes you think about something that you might have to do um, that's similar to this okay have a good day